Uh, hey, O'Shane, what's uh, what, what do you expect from yourself here in year two? And, and what, what was the biggest lesson you took away from your rookie year? Uh, you know, rookie year was great. You know, I learned a lot of things. And, you know, year two, I'm just looking to do whatever I got to do to just help the team win and uh, just coming and learning the playbook and, you know, doing whatever I got to do every single day to just get better and be an asset to the team. And how, how do you feel like you're, you've connected so far to this, this scheme and this coaching staff? Uh, I feel like it's going, you know, it's going great. You know, we're coming every day, uh, everybody's competing and uh, everybody's going hard. And I feel like we're learning and getting better every single day. Sum up. Hey, O'Shane, how you doing? Doing good. How about yourself? Good, good. Uh, just how much different does it feel this year? Because I know at this point last year, there was a lot of talk about making that jump from, you know, Old Dominion to the NFL. Do you feel more comfortable, more confident? Uh, definitely. After playing a, a full season, you know, I kind of I kind of already know what to expect when it comes to camp and like, you know, different schemes on the field and things like that. And, you know, it's good going into year two. You know, you feel a lot more comfortable. Thanks. Mark Lombardo. Hey, Shane. How's it going, man? Doing good. How about yourself? Good, good. Um, that room got a little bit more crowded over the offseason, right? You bring back Marcus, you bring in Kyler Fackrell. Uh, a, what kind of influence have those two guys been in terms of helping you develop? And B, for you personally, how do you separate yourself from everybody else in that pass rush room? Uh, you know, you know, in our room, you know, it's great because we all push each other and we all motivate each other every single day. And we learn from each other, you know, we all got different skill sets and, you know, we, we understand that. And, you know, we try to take as much from each other as possible. And that's what separated myself. You know, I'm not really worried about that right now. You know, I'm just coming in every single day and, you know, just doing whatever I got to do to help the team. And it's been going good so far. All right, go ahead, Art. Thanks, Corey. Uh, hey, O'Shane, how you doing? I'm doing good. How about yourself? Good, good. Uh, I'm just curious, how much of your offseason – was about you digging into details, kind of watching a lot of the stuff that you did last year and trying to hone in on technique stuff, maybe some some philosophical pass rush stuff. Was there, there a lot of that for you, or was a lot of the focus just on training? Uh, I say both. You know, you know, I always watch my film. You know, it's what you put out there. That's what other people watch, and it's, it's what defines you as a football player. So it's very important to always go back to the film, but. You know, during the offseason, that was most of the time. I spent most of my time up here just working out. And, you know, I looked at the film a lot because, you know, you have to improve and you got to do better than what you put out there last year. Did you see a player watching from the course of the last season that got better in the things that you wanted to get better at? Can you repeat that question? Okay. When you watched the film from last year, did you see a player from week four get better at the things that you were working on? And the kind of help you develop a way to, to kind of get your technique up to where you wanted it to be? Yeah, I did progress as the season went on. That, I think that's what you're asking. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I feel like I did progress and, you know, I still got a long way to go though. You know, when I turned off the film uh, week 17, you know, I wasn't satisfied with that. So still a long way to go and I'm trying to get better every day. Thanks. Okay, we'll go uh, Canavan. Hey, Shane, how you doing? Doing good. How about yourself? Good. Have you managed not to get your car towed this year? <laughs> yeah, I have. <laughs> it's been, there's three weeks to go till the first game. By this point, you would have played a couple of preseason games. You'd probably have an idea about the team. As you guys prepare for this season, I mean, are you sitting there going, what kind of team do we have? Uh, you know, not at all. You know, I feel like our team is, like, focused on – what we're doing in the current situation. And right now, you know, we're at camp just getting better every single day. And, you know, when you do the little things right, things tend to fall in place. So, you know, that's what we're focused on right now, just making sure that we got all the little things right and we're learning and getting better every day. Thank you. All right, Tom Rock. Uh, your position coach, when we spoke to him a couple of weeks ago, talked about linebacker DNA and uh, so, sort of the attitude that, that comes with that, with that position. Do you, do you guys feel, do you feel like you have that? And, and how, how would you just define that? Oh, uh, well, you know, it's something that we stress in our room and, you know, it's, it's something that we always want to have in our mind while we're on the field playing and when we're evaluating, evaluating ourselves on film, you know. Uh, Coach Brett came and he, basically it's one of the first things he told us when he walked in the room and, you know, all the guys are bought into it and, 
you know, that's something that we always carry with us when we're stepping on the field. And it's been going good so far and we're getting better at it. And what, is that, what does that mean to you? What is, what, what, how do you define linebacker DNA? You know, going out there and making sure that you're, you know, doing all your assignments and things like that. And, you know, having a good edge awareness and, you know, playing with an edge and, you know, just, you know, being, I mean, I can't go into detail about schemes and stuff, but, you know, just going out there and making sure that we're doing what we need to be doing. All right, Don Levy. There's 50 guys on this team that are 24 years old or younger. Do you just have to grow up fast here because there's so many young guys? There's no, like, oh, it's my second year, I'm still learning curve? Uh, yeah, there's a, we have a lot of young guys on the team, and, you know, I feel like we're all learning from each other, and, you know, we, we all realize that, and we're just, you know, coming in, we're bought in on what, you know, what the coaches are saying and what they're trying to bring to us, and we're just getting better every day. Do you get to keep the X-Man nickname, or does McKinney get that now? <laughs> Uh, we both got it, you know, we're both the X-Men. You know, X is a good guy, man. I like him. So you actually call him X? Yeah, I do call him X. 